We're out here today, um, exactly one week ago from the harvest, the last harvest video. Um, that video we got the bin full, and this week we got the bin dry and transferred into the harvester. So now we're filling the bin the second time around, and we should get her full today. Once I'm done filming this um, harvesting video, the stock should be dry enough. I'm going to go out with the stock chopper, or the stock shredder as some people call it, and shred the stocks on that corn we combined last week. I think there's about 20 acres there maybe. I don't even know if it's that much. Might be a 15. Not a whole lot, but like this stuff. It's too green to stock chop and bale by tonight. Like, see this stock right here? Green. The stuff would not be dry enough, so. Kind of sucks, because there ain't really that great of weather coming up, but we just gotta hope we're lucky. Over there on that hillside over there last night, we were spinning uphill, so we had to combine it one way. And then the right side of the hill got dry, and the left side of the hill got wet and flip-flopped and dad said he about got the combine planted couldn't drive forward spin it out up the hill and he almost it was spinning going backwards but i guess he worked it out of the mud so it's muddy this year but last year when we combined this field it was actually muddier than it is now so i'm gonna put this in the rows and we're gonna see what this looks like when the combine goes right over top of it Well, let's, let's hope I put it in the right row because she might have got ran over. <laughs> so, oh, there it is. Standing perfect. I did hit remember to hit record, so that's awesome. I'm gonna make sure that turned out all right. All right, I'm gonna do it again because I had it facing towards the sun and it looked like it was a little overexposed. So we're gonna put it in facing this way and try it again. Heck, I might as well film it. So I counted three rows in and then I put it on the ground. Shoot. Hit record. Should be right in the middle again. Anyway, we can take a look at this corn. This is our uh, Diner Grill corn. That one's not very good. We did a side-by-side -side with our DeKalb. I forget the numbers, but this this yield checked at 259 in the Diner Grill, or the DeKalb, 254. So five, this was five bushel more, 109 day corn. It was 1% wetter. But the big thing is, this stuff is cheaper per bag and we didn't have to spray fungicide on it and it still yielded better so you kind of know which one we want to plant next year wow and that is tough to husk back on there for some reason i've seen better ears last year was definitely better harvest but 259 is still nothing to complain about at all this was 109 day that uh, I think I forgot to say that DeKalb, well, that was 105. No, 107, I'm sorry, 107. So two days shorter 
this stuff's still green. This stuff's 24% yesterday. So, let's find that camera. I want to leave the corn straight out. Today is Saturday, the 20 something. 20. Last Saturday of October. She is. Sweet. This will probably be concluding this video since I'm not unloading today. Um, I won't have anything unloading footage that I know of. Because by the time I'm done stock chopping, the bin should be full if nothing breaks. Please don't break. <laughs> so, next video, stock shredding, stock chopping, whatever you want to call it. I never made a video with the drone on that thing. I think I made a terrible video like 2015 junk video but this one should turn out pretty good i hope this looks like volunteer corn man look at that this is one planter pass that's another and this is right in the center who knew a volunteer corn could have a monster ear like that i just pulled this ear off here that monster it's a 20 by 45. the only thing i can think of if we uh dad filled the planter up here and dropped a few seeds i don't know that is freaking amazing. A 20 by 45. That's, that's nice. Wish the whole field was like that. Which I don't think it is. I mean, about the same length. So these are like 16s and 18s. So, wow. I need to get to work.